Hi there, I'm Delusion Dispeller. I am a life coach and a YouTube video creator. And I have been on YouTube since 2009 creating videos helping people break free from toxic relationships. Today I'm going to talk to you just about some general information regarding narcissists and what it feels like to be the victim of one. I'm kind of experimenting a little bit here with my little zoom feature. I'm starting to learn my camera a little bit better. I use a UCAM type camera facility and uh, it's interesting. You can do all kinds of interesting effects with it. Anyways, um, I'm going to try not to read the information to you that I have. Um, it is my um, take on this topic. So you can agree or disagree with me, whatever. Um, as you can see, there's the butterfly that so many of you have asked me to bring back. So the butterfly is back again. Um, for those of you that don't know what is wrong with Delusion Dispeller's face, and especially my cheek, there's nothing wrong with me. I just paint a butterfly on my face because a butterfly is a symbol of freedom and new life. Butterflies start as caterpillars, obviously, and become butterflies. So hence new life symbolism. All right, first of all, in order to talk about narcissistic personality disorder and the abuse that is inflicted by a narcissist, we first need to talk about what exactly does it involve? Well, one thing we haven't talked much about is brainwashing or mind control. And I wanna to talk to you a little bit about that right now. I looked up the definition of mind control and I'm gonna read this to you because I don't have it memorized. So mind control, also known as brainwashing, coercive persuasion, mind abuse, menticide, thought control, or thought reform, refers to a process in which a group or individual systematically uses unethically manipulative methods to persuade others to conform to the wishes of the manipulator or manipulators, often to the detriment of the person being manipulated. So basically in a nutshell and in logical English for those of us that think on a lower level including myself mind control means you manipulate or control another person to make them do what you want them to do narcissists do this this is a perfect definition of what narcissists are and how they work so let me go down here on my notes Um, there's different parts of narcissism, but we're going to be mostly talking about, as I said, how it affects you, the victim. Mind control is accomplished through several different ways. Um, abuse, of course. You know, uh, beatings, torture, burning, uh, cutting the person, harming them in some way. Obviously, that's one way you can control, not you, but, you know, a person can be controlled, manipulated, and dominated. Um, neglect is another one. Withholding affection is a big one that narcissists use. Another form um, of neglect would be not giving the person food to eat or, you know, not meeting their material needs, basically. So that can be another form of neglect. And narcissists can employ all or some of these techniques. Um apparent quote-unquote sperm donor egg donor as I call them often will use favoritism as a narcissistic manipulation tool giving one child everything spoiling them rotten giving them all the attention telling everybody how wonderful they are and then turning to the other child and saying well if only she was like her sister you know only her sister achieved that level in school but we're still waiting for her to catch up you know just Rude, nasty, cutting, tactless things that they say. That can be another form of narcissism and another form of manipulation and mind control. Um, drugs can be used to control the mind. Cults often do this. Um, gangs often do this. Using drugs to control and manipulate and dominate and turn the person into, in essence, a puppet or a minion of the narcissist or the abuser. Another form is threats. Um, we'll talk more about specific threats on the next video or a couple videos from now. But suffice it to say, threatening somebody can definitely lead to them feeling like they don't dare defy the person that's doing this. 
they will do whatever the person says because they are afraid they play on your fear so stay tuned i have more thanks for watching as always eyes wide open moving forward